Hello, uh, this is uh, Nelly Deutsch to the rescue. Yes, if you have for some reason forgotten your password or your username, no need to worry. You can retrieve everything and get a new password. So let's get started with the first step. First thing you need to do is go into the login area right there. So let's click on that login and then you get this now notice what's here forgotten your user or password let's click on that notice everything in blue on the Moodle is clickable so now we do either or not both so if you remember your username I suggest you add it. But if you don't remember your username, but you remember your email, then add your email. Now, if it's the wrong email and you have a few emails, just try them out one at a time. So let me add my email here, uh, one of them, uh, which is admin at Moodle for teachers. Dot org. Okay, and then I click on search. So let's do that now. Click on search. Now notice what I get here. I get the following information. If you supplied the correct username, an email or email, then an email should have been sent to you. It contains easy instructions to confirm and complete this password change. If you continue to have difficulty, please contact the site administrator. That's me. And you can do it right here, or you can do it right here by going into contact. The next thing you do is you simply continue on to continue. Right, right here. All right, so let's do that now and go into our email box. Okay, so I'm back on the site and I'm going to go into my email now, but that's private, so I'm not going to show it to you, or maybe I will. Let's see. Okay, so here it is. Uh, let me show it to you. Okay, this is very private, but you can look at it. All right, so I got something here um, and I'm going to click on that. Okay, so let's do that now. Okay, click on it. And let's see what happens. And this is what I see. So next, I'm going to be very careful and do what they say. It says, someone probably you has requested a new password for your account. Unfortunately, passwords cannot be reset on this site. Please contact the site administrator. So if you get that, then simply go back into the site. Let's go back there now. And contact me all right so uh, let's go back there okay we're on the site and um, you're going to let's go to the main page and you're going to go into contact all right and contact is right here okay but if you don't get that message then let me explain why you could not get the password for a particular login okay so um, let's log in and see what the features are there are a few ways of um, creating an account you can um, create an account using Google okay so that was my way or if you scroll down okay this is if you cannot get another password. You don't have to remember your password if you've connected with Google as I have. Okay, and you won't be able to get a password from the system. The other two are Facebook. So if you signed in or registered with your Facebook, then you'll be able to sign in every time as long as your Facebook account is open. If you've um, signed in with LinkedIn, it's the same thing. So you cannot get the system to help you 
if you've used one of these three. When can the system help you? And let me uh, show you that. The system can help you if you've used a username and password other than sign in with Google, Facebook, or LinkedIn. So let's do that now. We're gonna go into forgotten your password or username once again. So let's do that now. And this time I'm going to add an email that I didn't use um, Google, LinkedIn, or Facebook with, okay? And I'm going to click on search and then continue. Go into my email box and see what's there. Okay, go into my email box. Now, if I've given the right email, then I should get the message. If I haven't, then I'm not going to get anything. So here we are in my email box and uh, there's the message, password request to an account. So let's click on that. And uh, this is the information that I get because this account was created without LinkedIn, Facebook, or Google Mail. Now look what it says here. Password reset was requested. And to confirm this request and set a new password for your account, please go to the following address. If this password reset was not required, okay, that's, so you need to click on this. Now this is really important because it's not the end of the show. This is a step before the final step. So let's click on that. There we go. And now, are you ready? Please enter and repeat your new password below and click set password. So let me do that now. Of course, you can't see what I'm doing, but I just want to show you the process. Let's hope it's the same. It has to be. And then I'm going to save All right here. So let's do that now. There. Uh, update. Well, okay. Update on my computer system. Wait a few seconds. Cross my fingers that all is well. I can wait around or click on continue. All right. And notice I am in. It does it automatically. Now I have to remember, but if I forget, and I hope you don't forget too many times, but if I do, I go through the same process. So this is to all of you that forget your password when it's not Facebook, LinkedIn, or Gmail. Bye for now, and I hope I've been of help.